Horus. Horus, why are you attacking me? When you barely spoke. Maybe that maybe you are just hostile in general. Hello guys and welcome back to some more Dark Souls 3. So uh yeah, I researched a little bit. Yes, I know I said I wouldn't do it, but I ended up doing it anyway. Uh because I remember these statues. I remember the last video how I went up to them and I was like, hmm, something about them seems kind of weird. Uh, so I went up to them and I was wondering what I remembered about them. And then I remembered that I have a friend, Hugo, uh, who you guys have seen in other videos of mine. Uh, I remember seeing him play this game at some point and this specific part right here. He went over to one of the statues and he hit it. Uh, and as soon as I recalled that, I was like, wait, is that I can't be right. So I went into, uh, into the internet and I was like, is there something about this statue then? And... Yeah, I I found out that it actually is uh, a person and stuff. Because I didn't want to go into my game and test it out without recording. And I don't know what to say to tell you guys if I just ended up doing it. And, and then afterwards I started recording. Because then I didn't capture it. And you guys might just think I'd be cheating or something. Which technically you can say this is cheating. Um, but still. Uh, something I remembered, so I thought why not. And it was something about this statue. Uh, I think it was this one. Although I'm, I don't actually know if it was that one or not. I also think I read that there was an area back in the catacombs I missed. Because uh, if you can see, I can actually just show you guys actually wait in this. Because remember how I said I didn't want to like miss large areas. Um, I still don't want to do that. And if I can look at the catacombs, I only have two. Uh, two of these. So I tried to see if there was something else. And apparently where the destroyed bridge was, there was another path I could take or something like that. Uh, that leads further down. So I might go ahead and do that, but first let's see if this actually is the... Never mind. Never... Okay. <laughs> I was wrong. It, it might not have been that statue. It might not even be this location. The thing is, the, the, um, the, the wiki or whatever I was looking at said something about uh, an assassin hiding as a statue. There could be somewhere else. Although, they did specify you had to hit. But I kind of, you know, I don't want to kill a character without knowing who they are. So, maybe I'll get to know later uh, who this statue is. Because uh, I don't know if there's a law way to figure that out. Because I don't really, really want to hit them without knowing anything. And before you guys say anything, the wiki itself didn't say, uh, at least as much as I read. As soon as I saw Assassin of some person... I was like, okay, 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 I'm gonna stop reading now because otherwise things might be bad. Uh, so, so yeah, maybe that wasn't it. Then, where? I mean, there wasn't one of the statues out there, but I'm, I swear it was like a church of some kind. So it must be over there. It just, it just has to be that I have to hit in order to do it. But I don't want to. I don't want to hit. Oh, well, I'll just leave it be. Uh, it's, it's better that way if I don't know anything. It's like one of those things, um, same with that flipping go goblet I picked when I fought the skeleton boss. I should have just let that guy, like, <laughs> they don't touch it. Although I couldn't continue without it because I did try. But usually you don't want to touch things you know nothing about. That's not good for you. Uh, but this one though, let's see if I am, um, like, I could also be wrong about this. <laughs> now I'm questioning my sources whether or not it's true. But this way I saw my friend hit a statue, and the statue uh, died, or something like that. I suppose I could have been misled, but, but, but with my brain thinking, oh, maybe they, um, there was something I missed, you know? But the bridge is back? Why, why would the... I mean, there isn't exactly much here to go on. I'm sure I also read about another pathway. Is there really no other way to go? No, I can see I can go down there. But how would I get down there, though?
Wait a second, there's a path here. Uh, that path leads... Okay, so let's see. If I destroy the bridge... Thing is the bridge oh okay what the heck that's what they meant by another path you can actually use the bridge to climb down i mean if i had not read that i would have missed this whole area so i'm not done with the catacombs yet i suppose I will be back after I've used my souls because I'm very worried that um, that they'll be gone otherwise. Why do they have to be fire, by the way? <laughs> the only weapon I've imbued or infused with some element is fire and, and all the enemies just happen to be fire type. At least most of them. I've also been conflicting a little bit with myself whether or not I should play this game online. Um, or debating with myself. Because the thing is, I don't know how often you get invaded. Or if, like, getting invaded is so horrible. Like, I, I don't know if it's like. I know when getting invaded sucks and you can get killed and lose your stuff, but. And then you lose your ember, because I think your ember makes it so you can get invaded. It's also how I can summon people. If I can summon other players to help me, isn't that kind of cool? Welcome home. Speak I don't know. I could try it like once well. every location then touch the and then see what happens. I mean, that could be a thing. I don't have enough. Farewell, but that's okay because I have other stuff on me. Don't uh, think I don't know how to use items. That's the one thing I'm good at. <laughs> use. Okay, that's a little bit too much. Welcome, her speak. Oh well. Very well, then touch Hagen. Touch the darkness within me. Uh, more health sounds good to me. Yeah, twenty-five health seems like a good stop point for health for a little while. Farewell, maiden. Ah. Talk. Aha, <laughs> uh -huh, yeah, how funny. How, how funny about Umbral Ash and stuff. Ah, tis good, wasn't it? Uh, let's see. Reinforced Estus. I don't have anything. A lot of Estus. I have one in there. Don't really need it. If I ever need it, I will just upgrade it. Uh... I don't know. Infuse weapon. Can I infuse it with something else on top of what it already has? So does it like split? I think I've removed the fire. Okay. Uh, crystal infuse it with magic. And magic could be useful. But I don't know if there are no weaknesses to it though. This is blessed. Uh, which means it might do more damage to undead, perhaps? That's dark. Poison. You know what? Po poison doesn't actually seem like such a bad idea. You know what? I'll, I'll use poison instead of fire. I know I probably wasted a fire one. Uh, but honestly, I don't care. <laughs> The items are there to be used, otherwise I'll probably never use them, so... Uh, what about repair? Anything that needs to be repaired? Don't think so. Me, my <laughs> so it's imbued with poison now instead. Because it seemed like fire was always kind of getting in the way. Okay, so let's go.
So I will kind of cheat when it comes to locations. I've said this before, but I will, like, if I feel like I might have missed a lot of a location, like seeing down and I only discovered two bonfires, I will um, go ahead and look it up. Uh, just because I feel like I need to show off that area more. Uh, it, it, otherwise, I might miss too much and I would get less of an experience out of it. But looking up things also kind of sucks, so I don't know. It's like I'm probably getting as much out of it as I'm losing anyway. But I don't know. It's a little bit sad that you have to look it up to find some areas. I wish the camera might just be like, oh, bridge got destroyed. Look down. You can walk down. <laughs> or something like that, like other games do. Like, I disagree with leading the player too much, but also don't like how you never get lit. Like, like they do lead you here, but they lead you, like, ever so slightly. It's both a good thing and a bad thing. But also means you can miss a lot. How strong are you, by the way? I do have Mimic. You had the Mimic. Hey, Mimic, it wasn't me. <laughs> Just so you know, Mimic, it was not me. Yeah, you fight each other. It's good for you. They are actually fighting each other. What the heck? I probably get something from that cave. Black blade, soul of a demon. I already had a soul of it. Wait, what? You guys saw that too, right? He just appeared. I, I did not make that up. He just appeared out of nowhere. One of these has to be fake. I can smell it. I can I can smell the fakeness of one of these. Probably one of these that leads over there. You're the fake one. I can feel it. No. Yes. No. Then you're the fake one. I can smell that. None, none of you? Okay. <laughs> I feel stupid. Well, anyway. Uh, there was stuff up there. I don't know if I got that. So, Black Sword. Wasn't that what it was called? It was this one. It's a Black Blade. Katana. Uh, I mean, it doesn't seem half bad if I were to actually properly use it the thing is it it has uh no it has a lot of critical i thought i might have the dark elements since it's called black sword but you know black and dark are two entirely different things i guess uh, let's see can, can i can i turn on online now i went online Let's see if I get invaded or not. Nothing up here. Maybe it turns on after I sit down at a bonfire or something. I'm gonna give each area one ember where I will be online and then afterwards I turn it offline just because I I ever heard and I experienced bad things about the Souls community. Because they love messing up new players and, and stuff like that. Now, it doesn't, not, does not account for all of them, and I realize that. But I tried playing co-op with the um, blue something mod. And we got invaded all the time. And I mean all the time. All of them have two lives. Okay. 
At least most of them. Do you have one life left? Okay, okay. But you're also done. I'll give them that they, um, they're persistent. Well, time for the secret room search. But you, you look suspicious. No? Okay. Probably not any of these, honestly. <clears throat> Anyone home? Oh, bonfire. have to double check. They usually don't do this down here. <laughs> Old Sage's Blindfold and Witch's Ring. Okay, let's see. So... So of the witch's ring, uh, let's see if I can't find it. Fallen foes shield more souls. I when did I get that? That's probably going to be useful. Uh, increases HP restored. I don't know how by how much. I should probably test that out. But I think it wouldn't matter too much if I replaced it. But I need to see what else is there. Uh, do we not have a... Oh, this is the richest. Greatly boost pyromancies. Honestly? Not horrible. But also honestly, I barely use it. Rather not go back there. Uh, nothing. Okay. If only had ten fingers. But it seems like I only have four fingers in this game. Boss room? No? <laughs> no, no boss room? Catapult. Am I hearing a catapult? I think that's a catapult. Is this poison? No poison. But I'm gonna fight something big here.
Oh yeah, okay, I see what that is. What can hit me from that? Oh my goodness, they have three shots. Uh, boss room over there. Okay, that's lovely. What? What now? Are you kidding me? You're kidding me. I mean, now I know why they have a catapult. Electric. What am I supposed to make in the state of you know? Why are you firing at me? There's a giant freaking worm behind me. Goodness. I think I have a feeling about what I'm supposed to do here. Well, why do you aim at me so? Stop it. What is this area? Oh, hello there. No, no, please don't run away. I am almost there. There we go. Yes, just got you in time, I think. Oh, no. I don't even know where I'm going. What's here? What's here? Something's here. Hello? Are you a person I can talk to? Horace! Horace, why are you attacking me? When you barely spoke? Maybe that- maybe you are just hostile in general? Consider not killing me? In the worst part is you're not even that strong. Now the question is, should we tell her about horrors next time we meet her though? I, I don't know if... It seems like what I tell her has consequences. Like, like let's imagine I told her that he I fought him down here before I went up. You think she would have like gone crazy? Because I got the thingy called Quiet Resolve. Which means that she has a good memory of him. And if I say he turned bad, she might not have any resolve. Ow. I can't believe I have to think about this in a Dark Souls game. I never thought Dark Souls had this kind of like thought process. <clears throat> but how did he get down here though? I barely made it down here. Oh well. See about this shield. Does it say anything? Uh, this was his shield. Metal shield crafted by the great smith, fashioned from rare guy steel. It excels at various types of damage absorption. Uh, parry skill. Okay, well, 
Maybe it's better I have to kill Horus, but he he was bad first. And there was also no indication that he was controlled, so uh oh, besides him attacking me, but that could just be him being evil. He didn't say anything. Well, here we are again. Lovely place. Is that a fire crab? Is there any path up there, by the way? See, my issue now is I don't know the path up there. If I don't know the path up there, then I don't know how to fix this. I have no choice but to run all the way around here just to see if I can find a path. I'll run over here, I guess. That's not very nice. Chaos, Tim. You're just a crab. I don't know if you're really... Ow. That's necessary to fight. There's nothing here. Anyway. Oh, you're not the same crab. I thought the crab might have run away from me, but it seems not. Nothing over here either. Really game, we want to find a boss like this. Okay, there's actually nothing over here. Ow, 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 ow. That was where I came from, that was the little hole I found. Ooh. I don't like this place, I don't like this place at all. Okay, can I at least kill that big giant? Wait, there's no path here. There's a path here? I hear a big thing. Although, big thing does not care much about me. Ah, oh, you look disgusting. Run away. Oh god, I can't believe I'm still getting hit by that thing. Can you just hit that one? 
Oh, okay, to try to it. What? It died? By what? <laughs> oh, by poison. I think I poisoned it to death. But this already proved that it was good investment. I still want to know who the heck is shooting at me with that thing up there. Can I ever get a good look at it? Let me see if I can get a good look at it. It is... It does not seem like I could do anything. There's a person up there, though. I can see some kind of big person. A roll, roll, do, roll. Okay, there we go. Oh, not to go boss room yet. Bonfire, thank goodness. I was worried that I might have to go the other way back to get a bonfire. I like to use the old bonfire. Huh? Who is this? Don't know if I rem Are you an NPC or are you a player? Before I do anything here, I need to go up, that's for sure. Make the firelink shrine, please. Hello, I have killed Horace. I don't know where I can find the other lady. I mean, she's not here, right? Uh, I don't know, but by the way, I don't know if you guys know what the... I don't know if I can find them now. What, what are these? Dark sigils. Like, what, what are they? Like, a black graping hole the flesh that resembles the brand of an undead. Is this just something I can never get rid of? It will never heal, but there is a tale told of a firekeeper who returned from the abyss and brought great comfort to the bearer of the curse. Eh, uh, so, so whenever I upgrade with her, does that mean that my curse or Welcome whatever that is... A Close down or oh that's what that is healed dark sigil oh my god I'm stupid that's what this is I thought it was a curse not the dark sigil so the dark sigil does what to me though it, it says it brings pain but I don't actually know what it does right, let's get twenty stamina because I am in dire need of stamina as always. They let me leave and um, take a look around. I've been taking a look around for a little while. You're still there. You're still here. What is your name again? Speak, thy honorable lord. Yuria of Londor. Yuria. Okay. Uh, so this is a forbidden one because it's a Londo Braille tale. So she's not a good person. I, I, wait, wait, may the dark. Wait, what? What were you saying? Yeah, she's not a good person. The dark sigil is the thing I don't like, and uh, the thing that brings pain. Uh. I'm starting to understand how everything is fitting together now. So, I'm a hollow, right? And 
since I'm a hollow, I have a dark sigil, and Lord, the, the Lord of all hollows apparently needs dark sigils, and she thinks I can become the Lord of hollows with my dark sigils, right? This is how I understand. So, she is one for hollows and not humanity, which means that if I were to, I don't know, it's it's freaking weird. I don't know, I've read this game with different endings, but I don't know if they're related to the NPCs. They must be, right? God, everything just became so much more tense all of a sudden. <laughs> I feel like a lot of weight we put on my shoulders. About decisions, I don't know. This feels too much like real life. <laughs> Giving me tough decisions out of nowhere that I need to deal with. And a lot of it is about killing the bad people. I could go over there and kill her right now. But I don't know if everyone in here will turn hostile if I do so. Right, so... Uh, that's just... That's nightmarish. Oh well, that is also going to be it for this video. I need to think <laughs> about what I'm going to do. I don't think I'm going to kill her. But I do think that I'm going to like let her be her. Or something like that. So... Yeah, we'll see. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video, though. If you did, consider liking and subscribing. Hope to see you in the next one. And as always, stay awesome.